Hello and welcome back to another episode of Phoenix Point. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the blind playthrough of uh, Phoenix Point where I'm trying to beat the game on the hardest difficulty with no previous information. It is time for Prison Prisoner of Ice where our operative has discovered a cryogenic laboratory Symes mentioned in his notes. It appears to have been a governmental facility, possibly a black site of some kind. As far as we can tell, Symes has came here to examine samples and collect them in the 1960s. Unfortunately, the facility has been compromised and now operates as a base of raiders. That sounds like something our uh, D team can actually take on. And uh, we got Bastard, Guy, Aaron, Ankit, the Doucher, uh, the Isabella, Penguin, Sosa, Carlos, and Goofy Goober. Let's go, baby. All right, we landed. And this looks like a great place where many, many um, bandits would be located. Those are a bit easier than our ready. typical enemies, so I hope that we're going to see any happening. I tell you what, give me that. I was born ready. Okay, well, we can see the first enemies. I think we're still hidden. Good, we do have two snipers though, and that's bad news. I don't like fighting against them. loud and clear on my way let's blast them we have disabled the lack of one of them unfortunately opened us up for a counter-attack Inside. Cool, bastard got one down. Heavy cover. Carlos takes equal heavy cover. And I think we're going to slowly but surely move over here. Ankit has the most uh, armor. Plus his war scream, so he could help us. I would like him to be accompanied, though. Moving to position. By someone who can protect and give Overwatch. Okay. How many enemies are here? The cipher of a new berserker. I remember vaguely that the storyline was that these are like rogue disciples of a new. And there's another Berserker, apparently one that has actually quite substantial gear. He's fully mutated. How, how does he get a full mutation? Like helmet, chest and legs. That Berserker here is a problem for us. No, oh, 
so close. But if I do not blow up, uh, so close. Oh. oh, did it hurt both of them? Yeah, it did. Very good. Let's see what's over here. Let's do this. The spider drones aren't that bad. I must say I've kind of revised my, my, my initial assessment of them. That berserker needs to die. Sniper has got them down. I love snipers. At the beginning of the game, they are just by far the most enjoyable class. Cover. Nice, we can induce panic. It means this guy cannot act uh, in the current turn. Carlos moves Let's further up. Loud and clear. Ready. And Kit begins to move in. The wall crying so that the melee berserker can't really hurt us. And I want to push forward. Heading out. Just picking up that other flank here. Okay. interesting not a bad move but it won't help him and unfortunately won't be able to reach that sniper but I love explosions. if they waste their stuff on on us that's good these two would uh, get hit together okay well they make it a no-brainer. Action. Okay, we have a solid position. Uh, this it seems like they are even more coming. We just need to be careful with what we're trying to do here. Let's start with the obvious ones. So if we blow ourselves up, they'll deal quite a bit of damage. If we move to here, that still would do it. I'm not sure if it is disrupting disrupting the guy up there but I think overall this is 
a very solid explosion. Yeah. Everyone took damage. <laughs> Same deal here. He lost his equipment, started bleeding and both of the legs, so it's a non-issue. The other one is quite damaged as well. Let's do this. Fourteen, ten. Ten. All right, let's kill. No! Style destroyed. Moves into cover. Moving now. Moving over here. Let's do this. I see them. Ready to fire. Could hit the arm. Uh, the arm. Let's try this. I think acquiring target. This here would be the better choice. Um. Yeah, let's hit the leg. That will slow him further down. Ah! And we're just moving out of line of sight. CC. I like what I'm seeing. Yeah, we're not really good at uh, fighting in long range with Carlos. Uh, let's rather stay here so that next turn we can yes. give everybody the um, frenzy bonus and instead we're just using our snipers in superior range problem solved did we kill the guy oh yeah oh yeah the move I'll be right there Unfortunate. All right, back into cover. Unfortunate. Well, overall, oh. so far we're doing good. Catching my breath. Hot potato. And that's Another grenade. Do. Okay. Opening. Ah! This guy must have a death wish coming out. So much in the open. My turn. No. All 
All right, more enemies. Way more. Oh wow, way more enemies. Taking aim. I can see them. Shake it, baby. <laughs> Indeed, shake it, baby. Requesting more enemies. Sure thing. Good. I am even willing to put in more. Yeah. Now with this the disabled guy. arm, I'm going. He cannot shoot back. Fantastic. Reloading. Ready to fire. Down to how many hit points? Four. So he's dead. Okay. That was a miss. And I would simply say knock yourself out. Here's a decoy. Done. Taking aim. <laughs> Disabled his arm, which is a fantastic achievement. That means he can only throw grenades. And we're overwatching. Can't hit him with the war scream. That's unfortunate. Ready. Um, this would be out of line of sight. This guy, to my knowledge, does not have a second. Um, Channel open. A second Sprinting ability to, to throw a grenade. And <laughs> we're taking, we're clearing this flank. Next round, we're healing. And Ankit will teach him a lesson. Move a little bit over here. It's mostly everyone with frenzy. And next turn, I think we will need to recover. Yeah. All right, end of turn. for it go for it uh. 
Good. Let's do plan? a couple of. Moving to position. Easy solutions. Number one. Gotcha. Ah! Get rid of uh, his arm. We can't shout again, but he has no more. No more grenades, so we should be fine. Number two, Isabella here. Can't really hit anyone over there. So I would really move over, uh, rather move over here. We want to recover. And this is where the kills are typically done. Bastard moves up. This guy is now in panic. Very good. Got you covered. I'm going. Style wounded. Good. Disabled his right, head, right, uh, which is a decent start. Overwatching. Moving to coordinates. Moving over here. Reload. And deeper into cover. Good. One assault uh, who has a heavily uh, damaged weapon. I hope that that also means less accuracy. Here we go. Uh, it means his weapon is now completely gone. Kid kills. Enemy again receives major penalties. Rolling out. Isabel moves in. That's another kill and yet another one who is panicked. Very nice. One hit. Ow. We're taking some damage back. This guy has returned fire. Be careful here. Amy. There we go. Let's not take any chances. Reloads and we're moving back. Even to here. Okay. Ready to fire. Good, guy Aaron. There is one sniper on the other side, which we got to be careful of. Carlos moves in, and can we 
This guy is the problem. Yeah, I'll just stay in cover for now. Ready. That's why I mentioned that it is a problem. Action. They actually have the same ra range as we do. Taking aim. Ready to fire. Need to try again. Hmm. Okay, I could crowd control him if needed. Yes. This place stinks. Well, that wasn't so good. Focus. Focus. We're healing back up. I'm here. Ready to fire. Yeah, I just want to hit him. You like that? hit the wall but that wasn't good good let's fear the sniper At the same time, let's give them a couple of hits. Mm. Got Aaron overwatches. What's needed? We're having another overwatch here. You know what? Let's also fear the <laughs> heavy. Help. Making haste. Cool. And Kip moves up. Taking a quick break. My turn. Here we go. They are still fighting. Good. Healing up. Switching ammo. Reloading, and this here should be distracting them sufficiently. Holding position. hit anything minor damage to the machine gun oh i'm on the move what's our plan good we can could try to reload yeah but that is not really helpful reloading here just in case
And bastard overwatches with a sniper. Done. Done. Okay. My turn. Born again, anarchist. Very nice. I think ex him exposing uh, himself like that. I'm on That's my exactly way. what we needed. Good. Almost down. This better work. Uh, okay. Cool for free aims. I think he's dead now, right? Yeah. Trying to reposition. Good. Full cover again. Isabella. Nice open shot. Moving to position. And hit. It's actually overwatching and Isabella moves over here next turn. We can move out and hit them. Good, more overwatch and done. You like that? Cool, that means he cannot uh, snipe again. Should do it. And Advanced. we're not done. And kid went through all of his heading out ammunition. Moving to position. Well, we got him at least an assault rifle. Isabella moves up. Nothing's getting takes past over me. Watch. Carlos does the same. I didn't know just how many enemies we are fighting.
dashing ahead. Feels like we've potentially fought against 20 with We're only okay. six operatives. That's quite good. Granted, the enemies weren't really that uh, strong and their tactic was also a bit disjointed. But still. Holding position. Ready. I'm on the move. Area covered. Uh, let's reload. And maybe we should just refocus uh, for one round, recover, recover, recover. No rest for the wicked. That was stupid. That was the opposite of recovering. There's always time for our. Oh, nice. These would be helpful for our heavy. Proceeding. Proceeding. Well, at least we do have reloading. Uh, solved all of our weapon problems. If we have new recruits, uh, there should be plenty of opportunity now. I am wondering though where that last enemy is. At. I'm on Overwatch. Oh, there is no last enemy. I am sometimes not the uh, brightest. Yeah, well, all of the enemies already fled. I should read the mission objective. I somehow just thought, you know what, kill everyone. Yeah, and I've, before going into that mission, I figured, yeah, you know what, we might be able to do two missions. Uh, the reality is we cannot. We definitely will need to in the 1960s, the Phoenix Project clashed with an unknown intelligent outfit associated with the CIA. One of these clashes concerned the cultures stored in this lab, said to be responsible for a terrible plague somewhere in what was then called the Third World. At the time of his death, my great-grandfather was trying to force the CIA to at least share some samples, but they denied everything, even the existence of this lab. It looks like the research was abandoned in the late 1970s. I'm not sure why. The samples are degraded, but if my analysis is correct, this is the Pandora virus. Sometimes I wonder whether the only reason we survived as a species is sheer luck. Right, so what I was uh, about to say is I don't think that the fourth team can also take on another mission immediately that's fantastic fantastic reward uh, Carlos here did not have med kits which in itself is a problem I think we should have a couple of them one two three four five One, two, yep, well, and kit really uh, needs more ammunition in terms of equipment.
having a sidearm isn't the worst idea. More hit points also wouldn't hurt. Same here for Guy Aaron. Isabella is okay on hit points, but we don't have enough points to invest into anything. I think she has a solid overall uh, loadout. Carlos actually could be more useful when also being the healer. And I would like more of those spiders because upon uh, initial consideration, I actually think that they are not too bad. Yes, it is a delayed explosion, but if you play your cards right, they are, they are okay. Deploy three spider drones with one action. That could be even better. But we need more uh, points for that. Currently with 180 hit points. That's also a little bit low. So let's rather spend our points there. Okay, we need to go back here. Um, da -da 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 -da. Gotta be careful not to become too short on tech again. So personal, um, let's double check. Team one, defense. Team two, still on the way of recovering. Team three, almost recovered. Now they are recovered, which means team three does what I wanted them to do in the initial. It starts moving there. One hour until we're being attacked. Yeah, that would be our next mission. There we go. That would be our next mission. Prime team needs to defend the living crystal quarry. Thank you for watching. If you want to have your own living crystal quarry, you can mold the like button around the crystal. All you need to do is like tinker and click it often enough so that it works. Try it and see you in the next episode. Bye bye.